Want to remove candle wax from a glass? In this video I'll show you a really simple trick on how to do that very easily too. So be sure to watch the video till the end. Because often you have the problem that wax residues remain in the glass but you can't just get them out. You can't press on it with your finger so the wax doesn't come out and you can't remove it easily. But there is a really simple trick and all you need is water. You should heat it up to about 50 to 60 degrees celsius because at 40 degrees celsius the wax starts to melt. I now tip the whole thing into the glass so that the entire wax is underwater and take a toothpick to help me. Because after just a few seconds you will be able to hook behind with this toothpick and can then quickly remove the wax in this entirely before it has completely dissolved. This is the easiest way if there is still a lot of wax in the jar. As is the case here right now. If you only have a little wax left in the jar, then you should also put hot water in and just wait. Because the wax melts and starts to come to the surface. Once it's on the surface, you basically just have to wait for the water to cool back down and then the wax to harden again. Of course, if you can take it out whole, it's most optimal. But even now, of course, I still have smaller wax remnants in the jar here. That is, I just wait until the water has cooled down again and then after about half an hour you should then also be able to see that the wax floats up here on the surface. You can also poke around a bit with a toothpick in case you still have some wax residue stuck directly to the glass somewhere. Now that I got most of the wax out this way I don't really have a lot of wax floating up here now as you can see. If you have a lot of wax on top then it's also possible that you can just take out a whole wax platelet and be done with it. If it looks like I did, you should dump the whole thing over a bowl with a cloth underneath so that you can dump the water down the drain here and then dump the wax or wax residue together with the cloth into the trash can because you don't necessarily want to have the wax in your drain. Of course you will still have some residue in your jar and we can easily remove it with some vinegar. Take a piece of household cloth, put some vinegar on it and start wiping out the glass from the inside. Because by doing that you'll now get the last little bit of wax still removed from the glass. As you can see with me now there's really nothing left of wax in the glass and we got it really nice and clean. If you now still want to know why you should light a tangerine I'll link you here a suitable video. Be sure to check out the video as well. If you liked the video then I would be really happy about a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and activate the bell so you don't miss any new video.